ultimately, as Sav once once remarked, we're we're just on the hook, us. Okay. Are you ready, guys? Yes. Okay. Yeah. Ready, guys? Yeah. What's yeah. to get you out of here by nine o'clock? Um, we also need committee assignments. We need somebody for the Harbor Commission. Have you guys decided who's going to do Harbor Commission liaison? We're going to split it, right? But wait, 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 I need to know so I can officially send a memo to the Harbor Commission and say these are the two designees and then they'll put you on the mailing list. What them. evenings is that? They're, they meet They meet once a month, sometimes yeah. twice a month. Yeah. Wednesday. Show me the money. Tomorrow. There is a Thursday. Isn't it the Thursday? No, this second? It's tomorrow night. Is it tomorrow night? Tomorrow night. Yep. If you will tell me. If you're willing to be the liaison, whoever. <coughs> Patrick, are you, are you interested? Well, Since Arcadia is now resolved. It's not resolved. It's not resolved. No, I mean, it's, unless you get on that committee. Yes, no, I know that. Yeah, I don't know what's going to happen with Arcadia at this point. Yeah. But we, need, we do need, they've asked me twice to send me a memo on uh, mm -hmm. January 20th asking for, for a uh, liaison. Well, were we not thinking about splitting those? Yeah, did they let us open it? Or do you have to? Name one. I, I think they would like to have anybody that would be willing to, to participate and be part of the group, but there are other things on our to-do list too that I, we need to have people volunteer for. It. Like so what are you suggesting? I, I'm suggesting you guys decide. I can't. We decide about the filing. <laughs> Why? <laughs> <laughs> Who's doing the filing? I know I'm doing part of the filing. I'm at least getting it to this preliminary state. So that's else. not a problem. <laughs> All right. So who's volunteered for the? Uh, that's like pulling teeth from a chicken. It really is. Chicken's happy. No, that's why it's like pulling teeth from chickens. Well, I'm still on the tree committee. Yeah. <laughs> that's really demanding. I don't want anybody to volunteer that doesn't feel comfortable. It's an important position. Why are you voting well, for the harbor? Can we can just work out? Like Patrick, no. <laughs> Maury, Patrick is much better at filing. <laughs> I, I, okay. So you and you and you all, I can send them a letter saying that you'd be interested in doing Harvard. Yeah, that's fine. Okay, you're a voter. You, what did Mary Poppins say? Not playing. Okay. Anymore. And I would suggest that we could. Are you back doing this forward. willingly? Yeah. You're not doing it under pressure? I'm doing it willingly. You sure? Yep. Don't tell my husband. Okay. <laughs> Sorry, a little secret. Sorry, a little secret. No, but he's interested in Harvard. Where was she on the Wait a minute, because what Kate's done with planning. You take a look at the agenda, you find right. out if it's no, yeah. true. Yeah. I go so when it's not all size, and if there's, there's something, something that concerns us, she goes, Yeah, get your butt in here. And she says, No, there's nothing on the agenda tonight that really concerns That's okay. Yeah. So, no, I think, you know, it does make sense, though, that we, I would be happy to split up those duties with you. It's and knowing this, that the Harbor Commission yeah. is being on like three committees is challenging, it? maybe. Morning, yeah. if you're willing to take it, maybe it could be with all of us understanding that there may be times when you say, I can't go this month, but somebody needs to be there. Patrick can somebody do it, but you can't do it. Patrick, you can get the understanding of writing. Will you be willing to be the alternate? I will. You'll be the alternate, you'll be the designate. Is that good? That's fine. Okay. And, and seriously, no, no, seriously, if you're on the list, Kim will send you the agenda. If there's nothing on there that you feel is pertinent to this group or the ears, then just say, well, I won't be there. I mean. You know, it's, it's an addition to this committee, so it's, it's not anything I think you have to be at every single week. And I think the last person was on it's found the same thing. You know, sometimes there are issues, when they do the harbor management plan, they have conservation areas, things like that that we're interested in. So, okay, so I'm Maureen for harbor, and then Patrick. There's an alternate. alternate. He's well, I suggest that we take number four, the new conservation commission member. Right. Uh, well, Patrick's a bug. Is that what you were saying? Yeah. No, that's that's not what I was saying. Who is the new conservation commission member? No, I do. Well, I guess, you know, I thought, no. I did, there are practical reasons why. Arlene had advertised many times for the conservation commission, along with all the other volunteer vacancies that they have, and she didn't get anybody. We had a couple people. At Expressed interest, but never really formally applied. So we're still one person Has short. Has it been advertised recently? I, I heard there was well, a question that went in last week. Okay, good. Because I talked with them. Um, what's her name? The new clerk, and she said she would do, put something in again. And I said we really are short one person, and we'd like to have that vacancy filled, and we need to re-advertise. And she said she'd do it again. So maybe there, there was an application. Was an application? Okay. I'll check. I'll check on that to see if there's something in there. But if anybody has any idea, they have any friends, they have any people they know that are interested in conservation, they're interested in 
fine. The door. Sometimes it just takes inviting somebody because sometimes people think that these little commissions are, you know, have to be in the know to be out of it. That's not necessarily true. Look at me, I'm <laughs> <know. laughs> <laughs> well, that's not true. You want dedicated what, volunteers. What you, people this <laughs> you want dedicated volunteers because we guarantee you'll be satisfied. Right? Okay, that's great. Is there any other? Oh, only other thing I wanted to tell people we, we, um, the Greenway Trail. This is on the agenda, but just to give you an update, uh, Lisa, we're going to hire somebody to do a preliminary path from the Neal Farm through that area and then over to the Sanctuary Trail. And the reason for that is that we need to at least clear enough, and she has the money to do it, to be able to send whoever does the permitting through there to tell um, us what we can do in there. And just keep in mind, in my recent correspondence with Tim, he reiterated the fact that as a CRC representative out there looking at the restoration site, mm -hmm. he had major concerns about opening up the marsh to any um, additional influence from the roadway or road right, traffic yeah. or disturbance. Right. So just be right. thoughtful about what you can Right. Everything. What we're doing. Including like a vegetated barrier. Well, I can say, I can show like, you. So not for buffer, not for filter, filtration, but for like visual and sound. Right. Yeah. yeah. No, Carol, I can show The red dots are all the GPS. Coordinates, yeah. spots that we did whenever Justin and Lisa and I went out there. And we went in through the wall here and then we cut diagonally across because there's very little wet here. It runs right down through the middle, but that's a real narrow spot. So then there's a mound of dirt that runs all the way down to here. Big mound. It's like the size of this room. It runs all the way down. So we went along the top of that mound of dirt and we got down into here and it got so dense that we couldn't get through it. So what we propose is that we're going to try to slash at least enough through there that somebody can go in there and look at a trail potential. And then when we get down to here, this is the highway right away for the prison turnpike, that line. Just try to stay inside the town property. And then possibly where that culvert is, which is right here, yeah. go maybe upland if we can to that culvert, if not right across the entrance of it, you know? And then from there, just kind of, here's the trail in the sanctuary right here. Just come through here and go to the trail sanctuary. This is the, the overlook area that we're looking at, remember? Where the, um, and that's what Tim the was about. Did we not do anything there yet? Yeah. Okay, what we might do. Well, I, I think what we do is we're probably end up proposing something. And yeah, we'll see what he says. Yeah, let me yeah. get my permit first. Yeah. Oh, no, no. We're not going <laughs> to block it. We're not going to block it. It's, Lisa likes that idea of doing something there eventually. But not until after the restoration is done. I think the RMC is going to have some concerns since then. Yeah, I think they're going to need some issues to discuss. I, th I think we, we have to propose things that we think are That's fine. good for the public and see what the commission agrees with. And if they do, then we'll just, we'll just back off on it. But, but, Get it out there. Yeah, but anyway, that's, that's the, the preliminary plan. And she's got money right now and she wants to spend some before June. So we're going to get somebody out there at least do the cutting of enough. I said just cut enough that we can get through it so that a permit person can go out there and, and evaluate our permit or application. So that's the status of that right now. Okay, anything else? <coughs> Any other new business anybody have? Next meeting is June 8th. I won't be here, you're going to be in the same again? Oh, good for you. Did you know my friend of Maine, the same lady who just